Hello, welcome back everyone. Nandito tayo sa ating second activity, module 1, Odds and Subtract, Simple Fractions and Mixed Numbers with or without regrouping. Yours truly, Ma Teacher Elizabeth P. Henovia. Magandang araw ulit sa ating lahat. Now, activity 2 or activity B, finding the LCD or least common denominator using multiple. So, gamitin natin ang multiple, paano natin para makuha natin ang LCD or least common denominator. Okay, example. I have here 5, 8. So, in order to get the LCD of 5, ah, sorry, denominator 8, hanapin natin ang LCD ng 8 and 2 because we have fractions 5 eighths and 1 half. Okay, para makuha natin ang LCD, sulat natin silang dalawa. Okay? Find the common multiples of 8 and 2. Pag sinabi kong common multiples, kunin nyo doon sa multiplication table 8 and multiplication table of 2. Okay? So, ganito yun. You have her 8. 8 lang kasi alam nga naman isulat ko na si 16. Wala naman ditong masyadong malaking number. 2 and 8 lang naman ang given na denominator. So, isa lang ang isinulat ko dyan sa multiples of 8. 8 lang. Now, we have 2. You have 2, 4, 6, 8. Now, notice, between the denominator 8 and 2, ano yung number na makikita ninyong magkapareho? So, you have here 8. ba? Pareho silang dalawa. So, dahil pareho silang dalawa, yung 8 na yan, gagawin natin siyang LCD. Okay? Tandaan, itong LCD na to, Ito yung gagamitin natin para sagutin natin yung subtraction and addition of fraction. Tandaan ninyo, pag hindi kayo pwedeng mag-subtract at hindi kayo pwedeng mag-plus or add ng fractions kapag walang LCD, lalo na kapag ka dissimilar fraction. So, 5 eighths and 1 half are two dissimilar fractions. Kaya, kailangan natin ng LCD. Another example. How to find the LCD? We have here an example, 4 fifths and 1 third. Okay? So, hanapin natin ang multiples ng 5 and 3. Tandaan, para makuha yung LCD, ang bibigyan nyo lang ng multiples or hahanapan nyo ng multiples are only the denominators. Huwag nyo isama yung number na nasa taas kasi hindi yun sila ang kailangan para makuha natin ang LCD. Ang kailangan nating number ay yung nasa baba, yung denominator. Okay? So, let's have 5. Reduce the fraction using multiples of 5 and 3. So, let natin. You have 5, 10, 15, 20, 25. Okay? Next, let's have 3. You have 3, 6, 9, 12, 15, 18, 21. Alright? Alright? So, between multiples of 5 and multiples of 3, hanapin mo dyan ngayon ano yung number na pinakamaliit ha. Kasi pag isinulat mo lahat pa yan, papunta ka pa sa taas, sa 10 or 20. Example, 5 times 10, 5 times 12, 5 times 20. Hahaba pa yan, lalaki pa yan. Marami pang magkaparihong numbers dyan. Pero ang hanapin natin, since LCD, least, ibig sabihin ng least, pinakamaliit. Okay? C, common. D is denominator. So, LCD kasi ang hinihingi sa atin. So, hanapin natin yung pinakamaliit na number dyan sa kanilang dalawa na makikita mong pareho. Ha? So, since meron kayong nakita ang pareho, nakita nyo ba? Okay. So, ano yung dalawang number na pareho dyan sa 5 at 3? Ayan, 15. Ibig sabihin, yung 15 na yan, yung gagawin nating LCD. Para later on, sa susunod na activity ninyo, uh, yan yung gamitin ninyong mag-multiply, mag-divide to get the similar fraction. 4 fifths and 1 third are the similar fractions. So, kaya kailangan natin ng LCD. So, what is the answer? The LCD for 5 and 3 or the LCD for 4 fifths and 1 third is 15. Ganun lang po yun kadali. Sana 
uh, makatulong ito sa inyo at anong tawag dito? Ulit-ulitin nyo lang ang video na to para makuha ninyo kung paano. Okay? So, LCD lang naman. Hindi naman sinabing isolve. LCD lang ang hinihingi. So, LCD lang din ang ibigay ninyo. Okay? Alright? Sana maintindihan, naintindihan ninyo at makatulong sa inyo. Good luck! And that's all for today.